Hello everybody, Arturo Johnson here. Um, just wanted to go for a quick walk, get out of the office for a minute. Um, so if you aren't familiar um, with uh, our videos, my name is Arturo Johnson and uh, we help life insurance agents to have a predictable and automated system online to have clients chasing them instead of the other way around. And so if that's someone like you, if you're a life insurance agent, you're good at what you do, you love helping people, um, and you want to have fun doing it, go ahead and click the link below and book a call with myself or someone from my team. Um, and we'll go through a free demo with you. Uh, no pressure at all. We'll see if it's a good fit for you. If it's a good fit for us. And if it is, um, we'll make an offer. And if not, no sweat. And so today I just wanted to come and speak with you guys, um, about one of our clients, Daniel. And, uh, Daniel is an amazing person. And the thing that we really dug in what you'll see um, on this video is we talked about the three things that every life insurance agent needs in order to be successful and um, the three forces that plague all life insurance agents in our industry and the first one is generalism right and this is where you speak to any and everybody and you help anybody and you can't clearly articulate to the market who it is that you serve, right? And so what we found uh, in talking with Daniel is that he was a specialist and he focused on a specific segment of the market and he was able to pierce through the noise and stand out from the pack. The other thing, the second thing that we learned from this conversation that I observed with Daniel is that he had a predictable uh, process to generate qualified appointments. And then you, what you'll see in this conversation is that he really didn't have that much time to hop on the call, so we didn't dive as deep as I really wanted to, but he did give me about 15 minutes of his time because he had back-to-back -back appointments. So um, he was just kind of getting started because he's in Seattle. And so you would see him in a tank top, kind of getting ready for his day. And I just kind of um, called him up because I heard about the amazing results that he was getting. And what he said is that, you know, having a, a predictable process in place is something that he could not even imagine. He couldn't fathom. And so he takes um, you on this journey talking about the abundance of how it feels and what it's doing for his business and his family, um, how he was able to get some of the dream things that he always wanted. And I won't spoil it because um, I'll let him kind of share it in his own words because it's, it's truly absolutely amazing. And then the third thing um, that he shared is a rinse and repeat process to take a stranger and turn them into a paid client. And so a lot of times agents are shooting from the hip and they're just uh, reactionary and they don't have a proven system in order to take a stranger and turn them into a client in one single 40, 45 minute phone call. And so um, if you stay to the end of this video, um, we're gonna unlock all of those secrets and Daniel's gonna share with you his system and his journey on how the AUM training program has uh, helped him. So I hope you enjoyed this video. And again, if you do, go ahead and click the link below and you can go ahead and book a one-to-one -one call with myself or someone from my team so that we can see if this is a good fit for you. And if it is, we'll go ahead and make you an offer. And if it isn't, no big deal. All right, you guys enjoy. There it is. All right. So yeah, man, what's up? Man, you know, everything's good, man. I'm blessed. I'm thankful. Like I said, I, I do have a, a 845. Yeah. Um, I know we got this, you know, we, we, we was trying to get it in before. But, uh, man, it's just, it's a blessing, man. I want to thank you for the course. It's been amazing. Um, you know, it, it's been, uh, you know, when you do good, you know, God says, it's a word in his book that says, here, make your cup run it over. And my cup has run it over where I have an abundance of leads. I can just turn it on and I mean, I'm thankful for God giving me the words of wisdom to put together from your instruction and for the lead flow to just be so amazing where at a hundred bucks, I'm getting a hundred plus leads every time. And so I, I literally, yesterday I was on cause I, I forgot how to turn it off. My phone was just going bing, 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 bing. I'm like, I have to bring on more agents. So I have a few more agents coming on. Cause I straight said, listen, man, I'm only one, I'm only one man. I'm not an octopus. It's only so much time in a day. I need help. 
veterans. It's 9 million veterans out there. It's no way I can get to all of them. But what I can do from the platform that I was exposed to from Ontario, I promise you, we can kill a game because the leads are there. I just, they just need to be hit. And, and, and my calendar is damn near booked out, which is a blessing because I actually hired an assistant, which it's cool because it didn't work out with this assistant, but I had actually hired her to schedule my calendar. But when I started my leave flow back up, voila, my, my, my calendar is scheduled out. I, I got to send you a picture of that. Well, you see, I'm back to back to back. And, yeah. Uh, yeah. So can you just take a screenshot of that? It'll take a capture of that and just text me that because that'd be awesome. You don't have to do it right now, but when we get okay. off, just send me a screenshot of that. So, so, so let's take a little step back. How did you even come across us in the first place? Facebook. Facebook. I seen okay. you on Facebook, you know, doing what you do. You got the algorithm set. And uh, it just made sense to, I believe the mind is like a parachute. It only works if it's open. And so when you said what you said, I kept an open mind. And I realized, you know, I looked at that 6000 that you was charging. I didn't see it as 6000 I saw it as no less than 60000 And then I even saw it as 600000 And then when you really turn it up, I see it as 6 million. And that's a mindset that us as African-Americans and my culture, our culture, you know, when it comes to educational, when it comes to spending money on books, on, you know, really just lifting yourself up, we weren't taught to pour into that. You know, we pour into so many other extracurricular things, whether it be sports, clothes, entertainment. But when it comes to that piece, it's a key component. And so your whole thing just took me personally to another level right in front of me right now. Every morning I have my goals right here. My things to remember right here and my my manifesto. So hold now, on, let's take a step back because. A lot of people skip over this stuff in the first week of the program and they go right to the ads and the leads and they miss the foundational things, which is who you need to become in order to deserve to have the success. Yes, sir. So let's talk about how that part impacted you. Going through the inventory was a, whew, a major impact. You know, and I think everybody in this world, if you really want personal development and growth, that's more what I saw this book, this, this course as a, it was more personal development with a bonus on top. It was personal development first. And what I do understand is that the more you grow personally, the more your business grows. That's just the way the, 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 the success game goes. You know, you're always looking to grow personally because when we grow, then our business can grow and we're able to share that with others. So that's what I saw the opportunity as. I mean, the inventory check, just going through everything from reading things to remember. I never had that. I mean, I, I've listened to a lot of books, read a lot of books, but to have it late, I never had a manifesto. You know, when I took the manifesto that you had and just tailored it to me, detail for detail, and boom, all the way from my character traits, to what I want, to where I want, everything in detail. And uh, I'll send you that too. I'll email you kind of my things to remember in my manifesto. This way I'll be transparent. You'll see what I'm reading every day and what I what I focus on because it's what yeah. we focus on that's going to, uh, whatever we focus on the most grows the most. Yeah. And I'm glad you mentioned that because it, it's, it's one of those things where the most valuable investment that's going to get an unlimited return is when you invest in yourself because those things are exponential. The tools that you right. learn, the skills, the mindset, the image, the self-belief in yourself that you can do anything, right? right. It's like, oh man, well, I can invest in this and that. It's like, no, 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 no. What you need to do is you need to develop your skills, you develop your communication, develop your systems and processes, develop dedication, right? To develop a higher commitment to excellence right 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 and you know make sure that your goals are big enough so that your action will drive bigger action right right and then you got to sacrifice what you are you willing to give up to hit your goals what are you going to give up and then really create that pattern of discipline that's the key that one word discipline and you know i'm, I'm striving every day to get better and better and better and 
better and better and more disciplined and more disciplined. But this morning, when I, because I'm up at five and I'm on a, a business training at six every morning of Pacific time, which is nine o'clock East Coast. And the one thing that came up with this morning, we were listening to, uh, uh, it was on discipline, bottom line. It was on discipline. And he or she who disciplines wins. If you, whoever disciplined the most, you win the most. Yeah. Cut, cut and drop. Yeah. And it's funny that you mentioned that because one of the modules is uh, why motivation isn't the key to success, right? It's discipline. Right. The things that you do every single day, your your actions, you know, derive the place that you go. If you take steps in this direction, that's where your end, your end, your end destination lies. If you take them in that direction, right? We all have a path and a journey to step on, right? But as human beings, we have the ability to take, make a decision and to turn at any moment to decide, I don't want to go down this road anymore. I want to be this person. I want to follow this person. I want to model success. So yeah, I'm definitely glad that uh, you spoke on that because a lot of people skip over that. So um, how long have you been um, in the program? Honestly speaking, I didn't jump in right away when I got in in, in, in August. I just knew when I first, I, I, I just knew I had to get the program, right? Um, so I waited some months before I really dug into it. I had other things going on. But I kept graduating, graduating, and I'm still growing in the course. Um, so it took me, you know, some months to really say, okay, all right, man, it, it's that time. Because I just be real with you and transparent. I had purchased my dream home um, here in Washington on the water. That was my dream with my wife and I. And uh, so I had took some time off from the industry when COVID hit. You know, I was before COVID, I was grinding, going door to door, <laughs> driving King County, Pierce County, just going. And it didn't matter. You know, you went, you had a you had a, a, a no show or a reschedule and you know how the game goes. You've been into the industry. I've seen your whole story. And so I decided uh, in the, at the beginning of this year, it was go time. It was go time. To, to, to make it happen. Uh, I'm going on vacation this Saturday, but when I come back, I'm gonna have two agents on board with me. But I like I like to take it to the next level. How about having my calendar booked? Right. I'm not so, yeah. waiting for a call. Right. <laughs> yeah, and that's great. So let's talk about that. So since you went all in, what's what's that been like for you? What are some of the numbers? What are some of the day to day look like? And then what's some of the premium that you've written? Uh, we look at... <clears throat> This just really, I just turned it on uh, again this this week. The first time I turned it on, I got a flood too, man. I meditated, I meditated, and my meditation for that day was I will focus on what I want to attract. And I kid you not, I was focusing on leads coming from my Facebook app. Well, when I got out of that meditation session, my phone started bing, 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 bing. I had five leads. That was the beginning of the day. Then by the end of the day, I had um, 106 leads. Now here's the key. I did not have, I'll say this, all of the veteran platforms and info that I really needed. Does that make sense? And so if you're gonna present to veterans, you need to know, talk their language, right? Let them know, okay, what are your true VA benefits and what, what do you really qualify for and what are your options? So I had to put it on pause, but now I just turned it back on. And uh, man, it, it's amazing. Like I said, my calendar's book. I understand this is a numbers game. And I was telling another gentleman that was like, you know, I said, Daniel, man, how you make 100K in the industry? I said, listen, it's multiple ways to do that. There's four different genres in insurance alone final expense, IULs, annuities, uh, Medicare. You can make 100K and all that. But the key thing is um, having lead flow. You know, gas to your gas to the car is what leads us to a business. Without it, you are dead in the water. And gotcha. so it's just the numbers game. And as far as my numbers this week, I wrote about, you know, let's say, I made about three, three, three thousand, about three, four, about forty five hundred just starting yesterday. Yesterday I was at I was at twenty, twenty eight, twenty eight hundred. Yesterday, 
My and today goal, is Tuesday, so this is the beginning of the week, right? This is the beginning of the week. I wrote, I wrote uh, 20, 26, 40 or something like that. Right. But my goal for the day is $2,739. Why? Right. Because my goal is a million this year. Right. And so that's a great point. Cause I was going to do my next question. What's your goal. But now that you have that set and you're just kind of getting this system, um, you know, fine tune and learning it. Right. So you can exactly. see the potential of everything. So my question is, is what advice would you give to the August you, right. When you first signed up for the program or the July or June, you that's been looking at it for two, three months that hadn't got started or they purchased and didn't actually start implementing some stuff, you know, what would you say to, the, to those people that's kind of still on the fence and hadn't went all in like you just did? Man, time is the one thing you don't get back. Go in and get it. Because God ain't going to help you get time back and you only get out of it what you put into it. And so bottom line is you have to put the time in. I would recommend uh, getting into it ASAP because you're going to grow personally first. Okay, it, it, let's not let's not even talk about the money. The money's gonna come, but when you grow as a human being, if you want to grow personally, dive in because that's where he's headed. It's not right into the money or going to the, the the figuring out how you crack the code. I crack the code with Ontario's training. I crack the lead code. I don't have that problem again, ever again. <laughs> I don't. So if you don't want to have that problem again with leads, I say first focus on personal development. Go through the inventory, figure out, I would say, write you things to remember, duplicate them, write down things you need to remember. Because it was said to me by a wise man, don't trust anything to memory. And then also create your own manifesto, who you want to be. And until you get into that course and go through it, you are not going to create and manifest into the man and person that God intended you you to be. You're going to be on the fence. You're going to still thinking and time is going to continue to pass you by until you say, you know what? It's time to make a change. And that time is right now, today, because there's no better time than today to make the change for a better me and for a greater lady. All right, cool. Hey, man, thank you for hopping on real quick. Definitely a blessing. And uh, you crush it today, sir. Hey, man, thank you, sir. You do the same. Make it happen. All right. Peace. Peace. Got it.